Hey, what's up guys? Conrad here and today I want to show you a uh, super easy trick that you can do to make your drops hit harder. And I just discovered this. I actually known about it for a little bit, but um, I have this drum beat and instead of going in and altering and spending all day making a new beat, I said, oh, I can just automate the volume in between the changes in between the sections and get it to uh, be more effective on the drops. So here's my first beat. The drop is right here, or the chain is right here. Right here. Right here. So this whole first section is kind of the intro, and here's my drum beat. So what I'm gonna do I'm going to select the track and I'm going to come over here and I'm going to put a utility down there. Utility is based on just a volume automation, so no matter what software you're using, just use the volume automation. I'm going to put it right there. And what I'm going to do is select the automation right here. Right now it's at zero. And I'm going to bring it down to negative 3.2. Found this out a little bit earlier with volume on it. So now it's at negative 3.2. Then what I'm going to do, I'm going to show the automation of the knob, re enable, show automation. Let's see, bring it back down to 3.2. So you can hold this, uh, I believe it's shift control to be more precise in your uh, automation. So 3.2, 3.18, close enough. And then I'm gonna come over here to where the little change is and I'm gonna select the automation here. And right at the change, I'm gonna bring it back up to zero. And that gives this kind of effect. hits harder. Here it is without the automation. Here it is with the automation. More of a change. go through all the different um, sections here because here's what I'm going to do. Right before it goes into this uh, second part, I'm just going to, I'm just going to do a little sneaky little run down here. I'm going to bring this down to uh, 3.2 as well. Probably won't really be able to notice it consciously, but you'll be able to feel it. 3.23, let's see how that feels. And then I'm going to select right here. And then right at the next change, I'm gonna bring this up to zero. And this should be pretty significant. Let's see. Actually, what I'm going to do just as a creative decision, I'm not going to bring this quite up to zero. I'm going to put it at like negative one. good so let me just kind of reiterate and just show you one more time here's the first change without the automation right here. and here it is with the automation Yeah, way better. 
Okay, so hopefully that helped. That was one super easy trick to make your drops hit harder. Hopefully you can use that. It definitely beats spending a couple hours. If you already like the drum track, just spending a couple hours and making all the fills and stuff. You just do that little trick and I think it sounds pretty good. So uh, thanks for watching. Uh, hope you have a good one. Bye.